All right, this is uh, John Brads from RunMichigan.com out here at the Ryan Shea Mile talking to Dot McMahon yeah, and uh, got to run the mile out here again. Uh, I know it's probably been a while, huh? Yeah, it's been a few years. <laughs> that, uh, I don't always feel real confident coming in. This field is always amazing. So uh, when I ran the Firecracker Mile back um, in Clawson on the 4th of July, I knew uh, maybe I had a chance to, to get into the field and, and be able to hold my own. Yeah, it looked like you ran great there in Clawson. Yeah, yeah, it was a little bit of a, a shock. Uh, I, I thought I could run about 450, at, like if I was having a really good day, so I ran 446 that day. That's, I mean, considering that you're, you've been running marathons all these years, that's uh, that's pretty awesome. To yeah, I try out. to focus on the marathon. That, that really is kind of my, my bread and butter and, and what I'm really good at. And, and you can kind of hold it your own in the marathon for many years. So uh, jumping down to the mile is, is very scary. Um, but, you know, I... I take some inspiration from watching all the, the high school meets this year as my daughter's in high school and I you know you just get kind of itchy for it like maybe I can get back there and, and get a, another fast time so yeah. um so how did it feel out here today uh it, it felt really good actually like uh I think I was very nervous to start hearing some of the the times that the girls have run especially the their 800 times of you know two flat 202 that's it's pretty terrifying coming into it but um once I got out there, I, I felt really good, and I just, you know, told myself just to hang on and, and be brave. Yeah, you look good. Look like you finished well out there. Yeah, actually, you got to, to finish pretty hard, which was cool, because usually I, I choke up. That's, like, kind of what you miss as you, you get a little bit older. Like, that, that top-end speed just isn't there when you want to finish. So today I had it, so I'm really happy. I was, I think I was less than or about two seconds from my lifetime PR, so I'm really happy about that. And that was in 2008. <laughs> so. Yeah. Yeah, I mean, I know you. That's that's the year you won here, right? Yes. Yeah. So how does it feel to come back this, you know, a few years? I got. We'll just say a few years a later. A few years. Um, you know, it's really exciting to to come back, and uh, you know, my daughter probably has a, a a grasp of what's going on now, so it's fun to share it with her. She, she wasn't even born yet in 2008, so it's exciting. Yeah. And uh, you got anything else coming up at all? Or? Um, I'm probably gonna run Crim. How nice. 10 mile race in a few weeks so I'll, I'm going to switch gears uh, I might do one more uh, time trial open 400 on the track before I do a complete switch to 10 mile training Okay. Um, I just kind of want to see what that's at Will you be running the USATF Masters then? So I, I would like to which would be my first uh, USATF Masters event um, I was a little disappointed that it's a different start time so that, that makes me question it a little bit so I got to <laughs> figure that one out yet yeah, I mean, for somebody like me, it's nice, you know, you get to get out there a little early. Yeah, but, it's like 10 minutes <laughs> early start. Yep, yeah. Yep, yeah, but no, I understand, yeah, if you want to actually run against everybody else and, and have that competition. Yeah, yeah, so if I guess if I know there's, like, some other women or some men that I can kind of latch on to and work with, like, that might be a little more comforting. Well, no, that's cool. So, any more marathons in your future? Uh, definitely some more marathons, but um, probably not this year unless I get talked into something, which is <laughs> totally possible. All right. Well, it's great to see you out here. Great to see you running the mile again. I guess it inspires all of us to... Yeah, don't to be afraid to get out there and try. All you yeah, can do is try. That's right. All right. Well, thank you very much and uh, enjoy the rest of your afternoon today. Thank you.